Hello, welcome to another tutorial, and today I'm going to show you guys how to make a sequence in Mailing Boss. Previously, I've shown you guys how to work with campaigns, and now I'm going to show you guys how to work with sequences of campaigns. So you to find this, you would just go to the email sequence area here, and here we can see our setup. We have each one of our sequences here, as well as each of the individual campaigns involved with our sequence here that we can edit individually now. I'm going to create a new one. These are segments that you can choose to segment your leads. This is uh, based on the types of leads you want to send them to. Uh, as you can see, none of my subscribers involved uh, fit any of this criteria, so I'm not going to select one of these. And I will select current and future subscribers, but you can choose the other if you so desire. In this screen, you're going to be able to edit your sequence emails. Uh, they're going to use the same creation wizard involved with creating campaigns, except the new feature is up here. You can view each one of the messages and create them in a sequence. I'm going to click add an email here to add a second message. And please note that they must have different timestamps so that they aren't going out at the same time. One thing I like to do to help identify this change is the welcome message is always the first one and then you can just do sequent message one. And it's going to change that name for you so you can help identify it. This is gonna be the second, the one I just added is the sequence message here. I'll just change that name to two. And then I change the timestamp to two days now. And then also here note, you can delete and activate each one of these sequences by clicking these buttons. Uh, activate the messages in the sequence by clicking the buttons. So after you're done with this, you'll just click done. And then you have created this sequence. If I go back to the email sequence screen, you can see that uh, none of these are going out. They are still in edit mode. And another way I could see this is if I go to the all email section here, and these are the three most ones that I created, they're still in draft status because I did not click activate when I was creating the sequence. If I were to click activate when creating the sequence, they would have started going out, but they are still in draft status. So guys, that is how you create sequences in Mailing Boss. We have plenty more tutorials on the way. And again, thank you for watching this video. I hope it has been helpful to you guys. And as always, have a great day.